Hi everyone, in this video I am trying to troubleshoot this particular problem. I just powered on my lab environment and I see that one of the machines is in unregistered state. So I am planning to troubleshoot this issue in this particular video. Okay. So the very first thing that we can check is whether the machine is in power on state or not. If you see here, the machine is already in power on state okay so the machine is already powered on and the maintenance mode is off which is good okay now let's go to the back end and see the status of the machine so this is the uh, uh, zen server environment okay this is the zen server environment i'm going to click on console so this is the vdi machine that that is in unregistered state okay citrix ctx vdi machine 01 so what I would like to do is, I would like to check it in the console first. What is it exactly showing? Based upon that, we can take the things forward. OK. OK, it just shows some black color screen. Maybe it is still coming up. OK, the machine is, is, is in power on state. And if you, you see the login screen here, OK, everything looks good. Uh, let's go back to Citrix Studio Console and let's try to refresh once again and see how it goes. Sometimes it takes a couple of minutes to uh, reflect the status. So let's refresh it once and see. Okay, the machine is still in the machine is still in unregistered state. So it's time to troubleshoot this issue now. Okay, now what we can do is uh, the the very first thing that we can do is let's log into this machine. Actually, let's log in. Uh, let me hit send, control alt delete. Okay, let me log in first. Okay, uh, we are able to log into the machine successfully. Seems like uh, the machine is part of the domain, which is good. Let me refresh once again. Okay, it just keeps loading. So let's see. Let's see the status in a minute. Okay, it is an unregistered state. Okay, let's go back to the machine now. Okay, we logged into this machine. Let me make it full screen. Okay, now what we can do is um, let's uh, let's check the services first. Okay, let's check the services. Let me minimize this. The problem is we have some bug with the Zen server, so that, that's why the cursor is not moving properly. Anyways, uh, let's try to launch services. So we can check the status of the Citrix services here. Seems like it is coming up. Uh, 
yes, you see the services on the screen. Let me maximize it. If you see here, Citrix desktop service is in a running state, which is good. And all the Citrix related services are up and running fine. Let me quickly restart the service. Okay, let me quickly restart the Citrix desktop service once. Okay. I'm restarting Citrix desktop service. So if you want to know the functionality of Citrix desktop service, it is uh, the Citrix desktop service manages the communication between delivery controller and virtual desktops. It handles the initial brokering of connections. So if there is any brokering issues or something, we can just restart the Citrix desktop service and see how it goes. Okay, now since we have restarted the Citrix desktop service, let's go back and quickly refresh and see how it goes. Let's check the registration status. It says initializing now. If you see now, uh, the status has changed from unregistered to initializing. So it seems like the machine is trying to get registered. So let me refresh once again. Let me refresh once again. So if everything goes well, it should be in registered state in a minute. Please bear with me while it gets loaded. Yes, if you see now, the registration status is registered. Okay, the machine is in registered state, which is good. All right, so uh, let's go back to the Zen Center console here. Okay, everything looks good. So, uh, if you, you know, uh, observe this, uh, issue the initially when we when we started troubleshooting this issue this machine was in unregistered state okay this machine was in unregistered state but everything looks good on the back end on the zen server side or zen center side and when we check the services here on the uh, vdm machine the citrix uh, related services are up and running fine everything was you know everything was in running state so usually what we think is okay the service you know citrix desktop service was in started state or running state so we wouldn't be you know thinking to restart the service to fix the issue but sometimes you know uh, you know there could be some kind of uh, you know uh, uh, connectivity issue or whatever it is so it's always good to re-establish the connection with the desktop delivery controller or DDC so when you restart the Citrix desktop service what happens is it, it tries to establish the communication uh, freshly with the DDC or the delivery controller so when that happens it tries to register and if everything goes well the machine would get registered so it's uh, sometimes if you Sometimes, even though the service is in a running state, it's good to restart the service once and see how it goes. So that's how we solve this uh, particular issue in this particular video. I really hope you find this uh, information helpful. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching. I will catch you in the next video. Bye-bye.